first grade, Miss Elliot here with another read aloud. Um, there were actually two books that were voted this time. Um, it was tied, so I'm gonna read one today and one tomorrow. Uh, the book today is called The Best Easter Eggs Ever. Now, Easter was yesterday, so I thought this was the perfect book that everybody voted for. It is written by Jerry Smath. <laughs> Springtime had finally come, and Easter was almost here. This was a busy time for Easter Bunny, who painted all the Easter eggs himself. <clears throat> Each of Easter Bunny's little helpers had a special job to do. Willow Bunny was in charge of weaving the Easter baskets. Jelly Bean Bunny filled them with marshmallow chips, chocolate, and jelly beans. And Bella Bunny tied a beautiful bow to the handle of each basket. I like your polka dot eggs, she said to Easter Bunny. Thank you, said Easter Bunny. But I need a new design for my eggs this year. I see polka dots even when I'm not painting them. Can we help you? asked his helpers. Easter Bunny thought for a while. Then he said, Maybe you can. Easter Bunny handed each of them an unpainted egg and a paint box with brushes. Let's have an Easter egg painting contest, he said. Whoever paints the best Easter egg wins, and the winner can paint their design on all the Easter eggs this year. The three little bunnies cheered, yay! Then each one went in a different direction, hoping to find something pretty to paint. Be back in time for dinner, called Easter Bunny. We're having carrot stew tonight. <clears throat> Willa Bunny loved the seashore, so that's where she went. While curious seagulls looked on, she scanned the beach for something interesting to paint. It didn't take long. Not far away stood a tall lighthouse with bold red stripes. Willa took out her wildest, her widest brush and painted those same red stripes on her egg. Because he loved spring colors, Jelly Bean Bunny's search took him to the country. Spring flowers everywhere showed off their beautiful colors as if to say, paint me. So that is just what Jelly Bean Bunny did. Using his prettiest colors, he painted flowers on his eggs. Bella Bunny walked and walked, but didn't see anything she wanted to paint. Then, looking up, she saw fluffy white clouds floating across the blue sky. One looked like a bird, another looked like a carrot. One cloud even looked like Easter Bunny. Bella thought the clouds would be fun to paint on her egg. But when she stopped to paint them, the wind blew the clouds further away over the woods. Bella kept running after them.
Deeper and deeper into the woods she ran. Suddenly, the sky grew dark and the clouds disappeared. Bella Bunny found herself tired and alone without ever having painted her egg. She was trying to find her way out of the dark, the dark woods, when the moon suddenly appeared. Then, one by one, stars began to fill the night. Suddenly, Bella knew what her Easter egg design would be. She took out her brush and by the light of the moon started painting her egg with golden stars. Easter Bunny was in the kitchen cooking his stew when Willa and Jelly Bean returned. Where is Bella? he asked. On our way here, we saw her running into the woods said the helpers. Easter Bunny was worried. We must go and look for her right away, he said. Using flashlights to light their way, Easter Bunny, Willa, and Jelly Bean went into the dark woods. Bella! 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 they called as they searched. Finally, they found her. She was sound asleep in her wheelbarrow. Easter Bunny gently picked up his little sleepy helper. Then Jelly Bean led the way out of the woods. Once at home, all three bunnies were put to bed. It's been a busy day for all of you, said Easter Bunny. Tomorrow, after a good night's rest, I'll look at the eggs you've painted. Willa, Jelly Bean, Bella. When morning came, Willa Bunny was the first to hop out of bed. Wake up, everyone, she called. Today's Easter Bunny, today Easter Bunny picks our designs for his Easter eggs. Here he comes now, Bella said sleepily. The bunnies proudly held up their eggs. Easter Bunny looked at each one very carefully. I've never seen such bold red stripes, he said to Willa. And look at those pretty flowers, he said to Jelly Bean. Your stars shine brighter than the real ones, he said to Bella. You all win the contest, said Easter Bunny. I want all of your designs on my Easter eggs this year. Then he hung a bright gold medal on each of their creations. The three bunnies were overjoyed. They started to paint the Easter eggs right away. Willa Bunny painted her bold red stripes. Jelly Bean Bunny painted his pretty flowers. And Bella Bunny painted her shiny gold stars. Easter Bunny smiled as he watched his little helpers at work. This year's Easter eggs will be the best Easter eggs ever, he said. Happy Easter.
for listening, friends. I hope that made you think of some of the decorations you have made or maybe you've colored Easter eggs before. Um, I like how each bunny made their own design. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow for the other book that I will be reading for you. Happy reading.